today I am back with another holiday themed video and this one is going to be a DIY gift video and this one includes mainly just like beauty products I have a body butter some DIY hand soap, some DIY body scrubs, all of them are holiday themed and all of them are non-perishable so if you give the gift it won't go bad after a day which is definitely something that I think people would be into. And I also linked all of my other DIY beauty things down below that I think would make good gifts. Alright, let's get into it! Snow, they will soon appear. Okay, so what you're gonna need is a mason jar, some bath salts, a scent of your choice and an option is food coloring and I also added some Epsom salts to the top just because I didn't have enough bath salts but you could also look up how to make bath salts on your own from Epsom salt. Next I poured it all into a mixing bowl and added the peppermint essential oil. I probably added about maybe 8 to 10 drops of this but really I just eyeballed it and then I measured half back into the mason jar to dye half of it so I just poured in some of the food coloring mixed in with a tiny bit of water, but you don't want to use too much because it will dissolve. Um, so it ended up turning pink, but obviously if you can get it red, do that. And then I just alternated each of the things to get a candy cane appearance. And then there you have it, you can decorate it any way you'd like, and now you have a great DIY gift. So what you're going to need is some olive oil, one cup of brown sugar, pumpkin pie spice, ginger, a container and some string to decorate it. So I did a teaspoon of ginger and about a teaspoon of pumpkin pie spice and mixed it all together. And then I used half a cup of olive oil and that's it. All you want to do is mix it all together and put it in your container and decorate it anyway like I've up my Christmas list. It's my favorite time of year. Alright, so you're going to need some coconut oil, white sugar, peppermint extract or essential oil, and a container. So right here I'm melting half a cup of coconut oil since it's solid at room temperature. And then I added one cup of sugar, mixed in about 10 drops of peppermint essential oil, and put it in the thing, and you're done. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is. So you're gonna need a soap base, a container, some rubbing alcohol, some cooking spray, and some flavors or essential oils. So the soap base I used was glycerin and it's clear. So I melted it in the microwave for increments of 20 seconds and I actually did it for a total of 35 seconds. So the second time I did it for 15, if that makes sense. So once it's purely melted, I added some food coloring because I wanted to do it peppermint, so I wanted it to be red. Make sure to spray your mold with the Pam so it doesn't stick. And then just put it in there and spray the top with rubbing alcohol so it doesn't have bubbles. And then let it sit for at least two hours. And then it should just pop right out and you're done. And it's awesome and it smells like peppermint and it's just so great. And then I just made this little cardboard thing out of cardstock paper but you could present it however you like. I actually have two more recipes for the soaps. I'll leave those in the description box below. Just make sure to follow all the same steps before adding in your additives, if that makes sense. And you can check out my blog post for more details if you'd like. Through the snow in a one horse open sleigh or the fields we go, laughing all the way. Bells on bobtails ring, making spirits bright. What fun it is to ride and sing, slay and song tonight. Oh, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Well, oh, what fun it is to ride in. So, what you're gonna need for this is some coconut oil, some cocoa butter some peppermint essential oil and a mason jar. So you're gonna need one cup of each and then you're gonna melt it on medium heat until they're mixed together. And then you're gonna pour it in a mixing bowl and let it sit in the fridge for about an hour. I would check it every half hour because you don't want it to completely be solid because you're gonna have to mix it later. I left it in for about an hour and it should look something like this. And then I added in about 12 drops of peppermint essential oil and then just mixed it with a mixer. I did this for about two minutes, but really you just want to wait until you get that creamy, buttery consistency as you can see coming up. 
and then you're just gonna scoop it in your container and gift it up and it's awesome and it smells so good and it's so moisturizing I actually used a much smaller container because it made a much smaller amount than I had intended but obviously you can make more or do whatever you want hey guys thanks for watching I hope you liked these DIYs be sure to give it a big thumbs up if you did and you can also check me out on all my social media I have a Facebook a Twitter and Instagram a Pinterest a snapchat for two more holiday themed videos and I'll see you guys next time love you